right, you guys, what is up? Welcome to a different game I wanted to check out and show you guys, and we could kind of look at it together. This game's called Inmate Survival. It's another one of those survival genre games that um, that we love playing, right? And this thing has been, I've, I got it, I got a code for it a while back, and it's been getting regular updates, like once every... Like twice a month and probably a couple hot fixes in between. So pretty active on updates. It looks fairly bare right now, but let's play a little bit of this and see what it is. So you can actually choose between first person and third person. I chose first person. All right, so open inventory by pressing inventory. So here's our inventory. Health, stamina, thirst, proteins, carbs, fats, vitamins, and sickness. That's a lot of stuff down here. We got crafting, materials, tools, medicine, placeables, foundation. So we can build inventory, itempedia. You can obtain sticks by hitting trees or from the ground. All right. So we're supposed to collect 10 resources from the ground. Oh, that's a bird. Do you see anything on the ground? It's, it's really, I'm a, I'm a little bit, um, little bit fast on the mouse. Let's slow that down. See if that works. There, it's a little bit better. I don't. If I start to feel nauseous, that means you guys are gonna get sick. All right, I don't see anything on the ground. All right, let's find stuff. Now it says we can hit tree. Oh, there's there's a stick on the ground right there, and a crab. All right, there's a crab. Okay, so we oh rocks. All right, so I got all all of the things, all ten things. I went way I went way down there, across that water, and all the way down. It said I was leaving the area before I finished the tutorial, so I came all the way back around. I spawned right there, and I found some stuff right here. So now we have to craft a. Sharpened stone. Da ding Objective complete. Hit a tree with a sharpened stone and pick up five sticks. All right. It's a... Uh, oh, this is it here. The old number one. All right. Hoo. Oh, look at that. There's a stone right there, too. Oh, yes. I'm just, I'm still hitting because I want to see how much, how much you can actually, oh, there, a coconut fell out of there. Kill a crab using a sharpened stone. Loot the meat from the crab. So it's got a tutorial, obviously, to uh, kind of get you going. There's probably enough sticks for now, huh? All right, so crab. I've seen crabs everywhere. I kept, in the distance, I thought they were like, uh, who? Got him. Loot. Small raw meat. Perfect. Craft a campfire and uh, equip the sharpened stone by dragging it. Yeah, I got that part. What is that? I'm hitting tab. It's like I'm making some kind of thing. So if I'm going to make a campfire, uh, maybe I should just do it right here. Like, because I might be making a house here. So campfire, what do we need for that? Placeables, campfire. I need another rock. Now, can I you hit a, a rock with a rock? Ouch. Can I hit a rock with a rock? No. Probably need a... Um, what's that? What? What was that? Plastic. Did... I guess a, a bird must have dropped that or something. All right, we need to find another stone. All right, so we got to build... A, we're going to build a campfire. I need to get probably going on this stuff because i think it's going to be getting dark right campfire okay so eat a place bam all right placed eat interact build oh there's a it's a double you place it then you re-engage with it all right while cooking the meat you can roam around and do other things yeah can you though like or is it gonna burn all right, so we have to add wood and take this meat, this meat. 
Uh, just for this first one, let's see how long it takes for it to cook. You see what I'm saying? That it, it, it has kind of a, it has potential, right? As a game, you're looking at this screen here. We got cooking. What we're gonna try and do is at least, hopefully, this tutorial gets us into a little building on this this one here, so we can kind of see everything there is, and maybe an airdrop. I don't know how often those come. Take your meat. Okay. Double click to eat the meat. All right. This thing. Eating. Oh, I was actually. What about this thing? Drinkable coconut. Drop the coconut on the ground and hit it with the weapon. Wait, it gives me sickness ten. Wait, I, I right clicked on it thinking there I could actually drop it like that. You can eat coconuts by... You can get coconuts by... Oh, I actually picked that one up before... Let's see if it works now. There we go. I just picked it back up and it gave me the uh, the thingy. So I got I got nine sickness from drinking that. So don't drink the coconut. You can use your weapon to cut some plants to gather three fibrous materials. Now, as I was moving around, I saw <laughs> some things like highlight... I saw some things high, like this bush here. See, yeah, see how it kind of highlights? Hey, hey, there's a rabbit hole over there. Okay. So I'm guessing that there's going to be other stuff like up there, but right now we'll just be working on the beach here. All right, so I think we're going to need probably, usually you need a fair amount of fibers, and I see a, a few bushes here, so... Don't go to the rabbit hole. What a bush is that? All right. There's a rabbit. Oh, that's hard. That's hard to do. I need a better weapon. I need a better weapon to get the rabbit. Because he's quick. I'm going to get these bushes and then we'll see. Craft a rope. So it looks like wraps, wraps, say man, wraps are going to be, rabbits are going to be, uh, food. Huh. Yeah, the, the weird distance, I try to go in front of him, then behind him, and then that little fella, he's good. All right, this should be enough ropes for now. Get these two, get back by our campfire. All this running around, I'm definitely exhausting myself. Okay, so now we're gonna craft ropes. Craft rope. I'll just craft a couple. There we go. Craft a stone axe, that's what I was looking for. Stone hammer, stone axe. A stone axe can be used as a weapon and to cut down trees. A stone hammer. Basic hammer to build structures or as a weapon. Stone pickaxe. See, this is what can be used as a weapon or cut down. What? Hold on. I think you got a typo here. Stone axe can be used as a weapon or cut down trees. Stone pickaxe can be used as a weapon or to cut down trees. How about to hit rocks? Because now I need five more stone. And those, those were nightmarish to find. All right, well, I had to travel a long way just to find the stone. The stone, I, if it keeps going this way, this is going to be make for really tough. So I'm supposed to do a stone axe, and I just found five. Okay. So gather two palm fronds by cutting a palm tree down. Use the stone axe to chop a palm tree and craft a basic shelter. All right, we get to see what the, the whole shelter thing looks like. All right. The problem is these stones. Look how far I ran to find, just to find five stones. Oh, there's one right there. Sometimes they, they appear like right at my feet. I'm gonna make sure that I didn't run by any on the way back, but now we can pot. Oh, I guess we can chop some of these palm trees, huh? All right, stone ax. Oh, okay, 
think this oh oh look at look out oh there's a lot of stuff here but what do i get okay it's disappearing loot loot logs i think logs might be I wonder if I should stay away from this. My sickness is good now. Sickness 15. Coconut will increase fats and vitamins, but give you sickness. Well, I'll hold on to it. For now. All right, so we got to craft a basic shelter. I Do we need to... I read about that hammer. Maybe we need to craft that hammer. Definitely can't hit these rocks. I think we might have to craft a hammer to get uh, to build a shelter. And if that's the case, we gotta find more stone. This is, you know, we always talk about um, running simulators. This is a stone finding simulator. <laughs> at least it is at the, this first day. I have a bad feeling it's gonna get dark. But I do have a, a campfire. Why isn't this one breaking? Is this not a, is this a palm tree? Ooh. That other one broke pretty quick, didn't it? I mean, I'm getting sticks from it. Why you know what to break? All right, I might have to move on to another palm tree. I don't know how many palms I need, you know? I only got two. Oh, a shelter may be a... Oh, I'm thinking, I was thinking like crafting like a base. A, sh a shelter may be one of those really small kind of lean-tos. That might be what this shelter thing is. I'm taking these coat. My inventory is full. Okay. Oh, I got lots of sticks. All right, whatever. Let's go down. Let's go by our campfire at least and, and make a shelter. So craft a basic shelter. I wonder if this is going to be like a lean-to. And then we can... Because we need... It, that hammer said you need the hammer to build. But you see how far I went for the rocks? Look. I started at my campfire down here. Neener, neener, neener. Neener, neener, neener. Oh! Got to pick up rocks whenever you see them, man. Those things are like Gold! Cause I like the gold. All right, so here's my campfire. What? There's stones just spawning in right here. Go ahead, keep spawning in stones. I'll take that. All right, so there's our campfire and let's build, craft, placeables, a basic shelter. Palm fronds, craft. Okay, R to rotate. I think we'll like face our campfire. Here we go. And then press E to enter and build. And it's got real in-game time to craft this stuff. All right. Hey! What? What? Who the heck's this guy? Oh, do you like my basic axe? I was going to read defeat the enemy. Oh, he's got a bandage and a food can. All right, let's drop that. Can we drop this? Ba bandage and food can. Is this dead guy going to sit here the whole time? I wanted to read what it said. A whole thing popped up about saving, I thought. And then this guy... Hey! Some dude comes out of left field wants to attack. Press E to interact. Oh, so this shelter only lasts for three in-game days. So it's, it gives you a basic place. Use the shelter to rest for the night. You can also save the game. All right. So... Let's see. I think if I... I think you can actually drop stuff on the ground and it, it will stay there. I'm going to put these logs... So that's why my in inventory filled up. Those logs... Those logs are individual. They're individual. And I think if we 
could drop some sticks down. What's this? Fibrous leaves to make more ropes. Maybe I should... I don't know. I will we'll just do that many there. And we got some stone. And then this plastic stuff, I guess. I'm, I'm just... I'm going to drag this stuff out and take a chance that it's going to stay on the ground. Let's go ahead and uh, sleep. See if it, we wake up in the morning. If we survive the night... Airdrops are random. They spawn every day between seven and 1700 hours. They may give you special loot. Okay, so every day. Oh, I hear it. I can hear a plane. Special loot, 326 meters. Okay. Should we go see what it is? 326 meters? All right, we're going. Can I clear my hand? Yeah, there we go. All right, we're going to run over and see what this special loot is. All right, well, I can see an uh, inmate over there. And I don't know. There's a river here. Can I get across this? I don't think I saved before we left. I got all excited about special loot. I do see an inmate over here, though. He's not... He's guarding the special loot. Hey, don't take it! That's mine! Does he see me? He's looking right at me. It's like Inmate Island or something? This place is crazy. Oh! What? Dude, I... I want... Oh, he's got a lantern. A battery. And some pills. Pills recover 60 health points and cure sickness. Cool. Dude, that guy just got oh that first shot and the flat backed him. Alright, what do we got? Oh my gosh, a Glock 19. Pack of nails. Another lantern. More pills. Glock 19 mag and four cloth. Alright. Um, if I put stuff down here. It takes it out of here, so that's good. This is actually part of your inventory. Let's see what the Glock looks like. Uh, that's not a Glock. That's a 1911. We don't have any more tutorial going. Interesting. I did not even see that. But I think we should try and build a base, but I need more. feel like my... Uh, I feel like my um, sensitivity has reset itself. I'm gonna need more stone. I think I need a hammer. Okay, so look, this stuff stayed. This stuff stayed. How many stone do I have? I keep hitting tab. I have six stone, okay. All right, I have six stone. Now, oh dude, my, my sensitivity is, it feels like it's reset. I just, I worry about snap snapping around too much to make you guys sick. All right. So to build, since we're, I guess we're done with the um, foundations. The foundation to be built, wooden house. Learn the blueprint to unlock this. So we have nails and we need four logs. And we can craft a foundation. All right. Inventory's full. I'm gonna dump some more sticks and palm fronds. And those lanterns. Okay. So we go into craft foundations. Craft a foundation. Oh, look at this. Okay. Wait, there's a circle here. Let's just do it. Is that campfire going to be... I don't want to screw myself with a campfire. I'm probably not going to make that big of a building, so... 
Let's go with this. Right there. All right, so interact. Requires a stone or steel hammer equipped to build. Okay, so we do need to make... We do need to make that hammer. Stone hammer. I need three wood sticks. Okay. We're getting there. Stone hammer. Okay. Now I've got to actually have that in my hand. The old number four. Build. Oh, there we go. Build. Building the foundation when, will enable more building options such as walls, doors, roofs, and more. But you need to have a hammer in your hand. Well, yeah, I figured that one out. So let's see. Let's see the cost of this stuff. That's what's going to be important because I only have seven nails. So we craft another foundation. Once you craft the foundation. Oh, look at this. So you look at the walls. Here we go. A wood wall requires one nail. A doorway, a wall window. All right, so we only have seven nails. That's one, two, three, four. Maybe we'll just make a single little building. <laughs> Maybe we'll make a single building. I imagine that E to interact down there is probably stairs. So let's craft a wall. They're all the same price. But we need four logs actually in our inventory. Okay, so can we chop these trees here or only the pine tree? I mean, the palm trees. Because these... Oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Look out. Look out. Coming, coming at you. Oh, those are stumpy ones. Do they count as the same type of logs? See how these are, the palm trees are long and skinny, and those other ones are short and fat. I wonder if we can, hopefully at some point, all right, so we put the hammer back in our hand, and then we can craft a wall here. Cool, let's, let's at least build this, see what it looks like, right? So we need four more logs. Let's keep getting, I'm going to chop down all the trees closest to me. Maybe these sticks will stay here and I don't have to bother picking them up. All right, how about this tree? This is a different type of tree here. Nope, can't hit that one. Okay, so the ones with the, the heavy bark on them, those, those big conifers, those big pines, whatever they are, you can't grab them. See how much space I have. I'll try and grab them all. All right. Another wall. I'm going to build it all from the inside. I don't know if the inside and the outside, they don't look different, but just in case, so you guys don't, don't get all crazy on me. Is there going to be enough room in here to do anything? Oh. Man, I almost wish I did make another foundation. And now this one here. Oh, look at this. You can move it. I can move that. Hey, now that's pretty cool, right? I was able to move that thing. So there's a lot of these games that take you forever to do something, right? You're like, oh, dang, I just built it. Like um, subsistence, right? If I did something and I can't like take it back and get at least at least half, maybe three quarters of the stuff back, then you feel like, wow, I made a huge mistake, right? You make a huge mistake building this thing. Let's see. So now we're going to build, we're going to build another foundation. I'm not going to have enough walls, but I think that's going to be okay. Uh, let's see if we go. A wood floor. Uh, 
Oh, okay. So it's you make the fr the first one is a foundation, and then as you extend it, it's a floor. I got you. Okay, we're doing good. All right, I'm gonna chop some more wood. All right, you guys, I collected enough stone. My uh, axe broke because I was trying to collect the uh, the wood, and I thought, you know what? Before I make another axe, because it took me a while to collect enough stone, I said I'm gonna try the pickaxe. And yes, even though it's it's a it's a mistype, I guess. Because it says cut down trees, but it should be obviously a pickaxe for rocks. And there's rocks everywhere, so it's no longer Rock Simulator. We officially have the ability to get a lot of stones. Wait, some of that's ore. Did you see that? Some of that was ore. Iron ore. Interesting. Okay. Well, I need to craft another axe. I need to craft another axe. Woo! My inventory's full, though. Just dropping stuff everywhere. Let's see, what else can I drop right now? Actually, I should be able to craft something because I got wood in my inventory. It's raining, too, by the way. All right, so number four. And here, we'll make another wall here. Nice. I don't... I don't think I'm going to put any windows in. Need another log. But I should be able to now grab some sticks. And hopefully, I have enough fibers. For those, we got to make another axe. Stone axe. Perfect. Go back to the player. Put the hammer. This knife. We'll move this knife thingy for now. Okay. Oh, um, I was over... Where was I? By this rabbit hole. This was the tree that my axe broke on right here. And right up there on that little hill, that right there, I saw what looked like a watermelon. And guess what? It was a watermelon. And it gave me a little bit of food, a little bit of thirst, and no sickness, right? So it was kind of a, it was a random watermelon there. How many more spots do I have? I don't have any more spots. All right, let's go. We got our base. We're building our base. Curious what else we're going to be able to build in here. Because this, this thingy here only lasts... What did it say? Like three in-game days. I'm not going to have enough nails to to finish this thing. But we'll make another wall here. I can only make one more wall. I can't even make a doorway. Which means I guess I'll have to wait till the morning and wait for another drop and go after that and hope there's nails in that? Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. All right. Last, not last nail here. I guess I could... I guess I could put a... Wait, is it... Is the amount of logs going down? Like, the more I craft? Wait. Can I craft a wall window? I have the hammer in my hand. Oh, I only have two of four logs. I'm an idiot. Why didn't you guys say something? <laughs> like, why isn't anything working? Like, did the amount go down? No, the, the one on the right... It, the one on the left is how much you have. The one on the... The one on the right is um, how much you need. Which is weird. That's... That's kind of reverse in my opinion, but that's okay. You gotta learn each game for what it is, right? Alright, so this will be our last nail. We won't be able to put like a doorway or a door or a roof on yet. Which means, I don't know if it's gonna actually like give us the ability to make this an actual house. Okay, so my stone hammer broke. 
Oh, we broke before I could actually finish. Um, I have one rope. I have logs, craft, tools. Stone hammer. I need two more wooden sticks. Two more wooden sticks, please. Player. The old number four. What do you guys think? I mean, obviously it's light, right? It's light on, on content, but it it kind of feels like it's got a, a halfway decent base of, of like, you look, there's, there's building, there's tools and crafting and all that stuff. All right, so that's done. <laughs> now, where's my, uh, how's my stuff? Carbs, I'm kind of low on everything. What what did it say that the the coconuts gave us? Coconuts sitting in there. All right. Coconuts give us carbs, but it gives us sickness. My health is all the way up. What does this thing give us? Oh wow. All right, let's just eat this thing then. So that's pretty good. And it's an empty can can be used for crafting. What I'm curious about is now we found some, let's see, itempedia resources, sticks, small stone. Metal scraps randomly spawn on the beach or can be obtained loots, plastics, fibrous logs, palms, animal skins, cloth, leather, feathers, iron ore. You can get iron ore by destroying certain boulders using the pickaxe. Get iron ingot by melting iron ore in the furnace. That's what I was looking for. You can get sulfur ore by destroying certain rocks. Sulfur. So batteries, animal bones, skin, charcoal, gunpowder, plastic bottles, flask, rope. Nails can be crafted at the en anvil. You, you think they meant anvil? I don't know. Maybe there's an anvil. Maybe I'm maybe I'm the moron. I don't know. Tools and armament. Stone spear, wooden bow, pistol, pistol ammo. AK-47. What? Shotgun. Sniper. Bone armor. Bone helmet. Ooga booga. Okay, so. I don't think we're to the point where we can craft a... We probably need a workbench. The workbench enables more crafting. Okay, so one rope and three more logs. Let's do that. Let's do that at least, right? Uh, I need three more logs, please. I'll just chop one of these bad boys down. We'll take it that way. I'm trying to give you guys, I'm trying to see for myself and give you guys like an overview of what we're looking at here, you know? So the workbench, that's pretty typical of, of these games, right? You craft something to open up a, a greater crafting menu. Okay, so is that enough logs? Four logs, craft, placeables. Yes. All right. We probably want to put the workbench inside our house. I'm guessing. I wonder how big it is. I can put it by this window. I don't want to sleep by the window. What if someone reaches in and grabs me in the middle of the night? Uh, seems like it wants to be outside. Yep, it wants to be outside, so we'll we'll put it outside then. I would you can only rotate one direction. There we go. Gonna have our hammer in our hand. I like the things that you can build without nails. Okay, so let's take a look at this now. Right, I don't want to do that. There we go. 
Workbench. Use the workbench to create other items from different types. So, materials. Improve bag. Crocodile skin and let. What? There's crocodiles in this game? This bag will double your inventory space. Ooh, I like that. Plastic bottles, coconut flasks, gunpowder. So we need charcoal and sulfur, leather, and then armament. So if we get bones, obviously. Wood stick and rope to make a bow. How about the arrows? Feathers. Mmm. Gunpowder. Glock magazine. Clip of 12. That's... That's... <laughs> Two different words meaning the same thing. Shotgun shell, AK, sniper. So you want to keep the mags, I guess. All right. So this didn't give me the ability to make the workbench. I mean, the workbench. This didn't give me the ability to... Let's see, I was going to put some more... Put some sticks in here. Light a fire. Ooh, it's dark. All right. Produce charcoal. Where those sticks go? Add wood. Okay. The campfire can be upgraded with the right materials. Upgraded campfire with a cooking pot to enable more cooking options. But we need a bucket. Okay. Cool. All right. So we're burning. Hopefully we don't burn down our house. I guess we'll have to sleep is it's really dark out oh, i should have tried the lanterns i set them on the i set the lanterns down in here pick up or pick up hmm what happened to light so m okay all right, so what do you guys think? I mean, it's talking about crocodiles and all enemy camp. What? Dude. There's two enemy camps over there. They probably have sniper rifles. We didn't say... Oh, it said that that drop could be any time during the day, right? That drop could be any time during the day interesting let me know what you guys think you guys give it a thumbs up even if you don't like it right that just lets me know that you enjoyed me attempting to show you something different and what do you think i'm i'm curious to see what you guys think like i said obviously it feels pretty bare bones right but what day one day two is always rough on all these games but look the only thing holding us off from building a pretty cool camp would be nails. Because we can get the wood. Now we can get the stone. We can do all that stuff, right? It's like, this thing looks like it actually has sulfur in it, doesn't it? See that yellow? Let's see. Because one of them, one of the other ones dropped iron for us. Let's see if this bad boy drops us some sulfur. Stone, stone. Sulfur. Sulfur. Yeah. So you can identify it by looking at the looking at the thing. Cool. Like I said, you guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys think. If look, we see the recipes, right? We know there's animals. We know there's all kinds of weapons. We know there's crocodiles. There's got to be some kind of animal for leather. There's obviously enemies. There's two enemy camps over there. Are they... Did I just hear them coming over here? There's airdrops. So, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. And if I should do another episode. Maybe get a little bit farther along and try, try to see what else is up. Maybe we could go check out the enemy camps or something. Alright, that's going to do it for me, you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.